Yeah, uh, so it's Mike reporting for ACCars.com. I'm fortunate to meet Molly again today. I have to meet you yesterday. Yeah, Welcome no. to London, Molly. Thanks. Yeah, it's <laughs> lovely to be here. So, yeah, we met you yesterday, postcard shooting, uh, freezing cold. <laughs> But this is what I was expecting to do, so I hadn't like dressed accordingly at all. Um, luckily, I had my leather jacket with me, otherwise I'd have literally been freezing. I'd st- I stole someone's coat in the end because I was like, "Sorry, but I'm gonna like I've got a gig to do tomorrow." <laughs> it's a good day, though. I think it, I think things went really well. Actually. I thought it was really fun. Um, my friends thought it was really fun, but they are starting to get really annoyed with me, like <laughs> roping them into these like random things, and they're like, "Whatever's next?" But, um, but they're enjoying the, it. Yeah, oh, they're loving it really. I think. Yeah. Tell me. I, I how did you feel your performance went down last weekend in, in Amsterdam? Well, I thought really well. It was really so. Sur- it felt yeah. It felt like a big cheer. It was really surreal coming out to everyone chanting my name. I mean, that was like obviously like totally unexpected and such an amazing welcome onto a stage. I mean, that's it. That's a dream come true, really. So um, yeah, I don't know. I felt like it went really well. It all happened so fast. It was just over before I knew it. So. Um, Slightly different questions this week. Uh, we went trolling through the uh, Russian and Belarusian and Ukrainian fan networks, okay. and uh, we've got a few random questions come back. Um, so the first one, uh, we're not entirely sure where all these came from, so but they came from somewhere east. <laughs> yeah. Um, can you tell us how Children of the Universe came about? I know the answer. To this, but sure. Like yeah. Um, it came about in a few ways um, obviously it came about once I'd already been approached to do the competition so I was sitting down writing for the competition specifically um, and I was just inspired by a poem um, by a guy called Max Ernum and there's a section in that poem that's really beautiful and it says um, you are a child of the universe no more no less than the trees and the stars you have a right to be here and whether or not it is clear to you no doubt the universe is unfolding as it should so um, it's, it was sort of inspired by that um, and yeah then it, and that's it really. so a lot of fate really a fate, a fate yeah, sort of thing is, I think it's um, for me that part of the poem has been comforting when I've been in probably dark quite dark places and um sometimes you have you know you do think what the hell like why is this happening and and then and it kind of is just a bit reassuring that things will unfold and there's there's you know usually light at the end of the tunnel so uh another random question for you how many songs are there ready for the new album too many actually (laughs) yeah so maybe yeah so we've got to whittle them down now um and i'd like to write more i'm like typical i think of any songwriter and i'm always looking to the next one so um i'm really i haven't had much time to write at the minute i'm not complaining because i'm having so much fun but like i'm just i've got so many ideas and i just can't wait to get like a couple of days where i can just sit down and like get them get them out so um yeah that question was um which which genre of music do you prefer to work in this was another question that somebody asked because you've got some quite different styles out there that's a really good question actually um and a really hard one for me to answer because I, it really depends on my mood and it re- i really find it hard to um limit myself to a specific genre and i hate it and i think that's actually been a problem with regards to me kind of getting a deal or being noticed by people or because i can't i don't know how i find it very frustrating to be like right, i'm just going to do this kind of music um and the album that we're working on is really quite broad so um, I feel so excited that the label are kind of happy to get, roll with that and uh, hopefully people will like it. And then just following on a little bit from that, how did the collaboration with is it Andreas, Andreas Hansen Anders Hansen, Anders Hansen, yeah he, um, he saw a YouTube video of me, um, I'd written a song called Flowers by the Road and at that time I was, I was really rubbish at, I still am actually really rubbish at YouTube and like putting things up and like, like yeah, it's get, yeah we are as well. Yeah I'm, I'm really rubbish at it and um, all my friends are like you just got, you know, when you next write a song just, just it and put it on the internet so people can see so I did and um, he happened to see that and was like I'd really like to work with you and at the time I really wasn't sure if I was an artist I thought maybe I was just a songwriter and um, went over there we wrote, we like wrote some really cool tracks some of which will be in fact one of which I'm forming tonight and um, uh, yeah and it, he was like no you are an artist What's the name of the song you're performing tonight? lock up your daughter oh. Okay. Mm-hmm. There's a story there, isn't there? Yes. <laughs> okay. um, so, just final fan question from us was: uh, Has the international media interest been a surprise for you? Massive surprise. Yeah. 
Yeah, massive surprise. Everything's been a bit of a surprise, to be honest. I just, I mean, the whole thing is obviously new to me. Um, but I'm really surprised at um, how the UK have responded. And yeah. then I'm really surprised at how, yeah, the international... You got a taster in Amsterdam last week. Yeah, and everyone's so nice. Like, just really lovely, really supportive. Good. And it's really hard to gauge kind of what's normal. Yeah. And but, it, but whatever, even if it's not, it's really nice to have that kind of warm welcome. Everyone's really positive, everyone's really encouraging. And um, yeah, it's, it's brilliant. So, just uh, another thing that I just wanted to talk about. Next week, there's a gig. You're playing a live gig in London. How does that come about? Tell me a bit more about that. That is, um, yeah, I mean, that's sort of me in my comfort zone. That's just uh, me doing a gig um, of some of the songs that are going to be on the album. Okay, so I'm going to be there. Yeah, so you're going to get a bit of a preview okay. um, of, of some of the tracks. We'll probably do the two, the because the I'm doing um, two tonight as well as children of the universe so we'll obviously be doing those um but yeah i can't wait that's just come about because you know we want to continue doing what we were doing before it's in yep sure it's in madam jojo's which is in soho in london um you can get tickets they're selling out fast actually um it's not it is quite small and yeah we're wondering whether we should have got a big one now actually but um so um if you go to my website, I think you can get tickets, and also my Facebook page, Official Molly, yeah. you'll go there. Because if I tell you now, I'll probably tell you wrong. Yeah, <laughs> you'll be okay. like, no, no, she no, told no. us They'll to go to this website, it. and they're, they're not there. But yeah, so that's that's basically just me doing my thing, which I was doing before Eurovision and gigging with my band, and like that's it. So I can't wait. I really can't wait. So just two final things from me. Personal message for the ACCars.com readers, as always. Yes. And... Can you sing a bit of that other song you're going to sing to no. for us tonight? No, come on, don't tease me like that. No. That <laughs> one. But yeah, personal message for me is because the comedy is really fantastic. Okay. And a few lines of children. Sure. University. Okay. Um, I just. Yeah, yeah, I don't. Um, yeah, just thank you for your support. Uh, thanks for listening to everything that you've been listening to. Thank you for messaging in. Thank you for any of your questions. Anything you want to know, you know, you can always Facebook me, go to my website, things like that. I do try and respond as much as I can, um, but I'm quite busy, so sorry if I'm not getting back to everybody. Um, but yeah, thank you, and I hope you enjoy everything that you see from me um, in the future. Okay, and just one line from Children of the Universe. Okay. We're children of the universe, don't you know? Molly, have a great day. Uh, get outside in the sun. It's rare in London, really, isn't it? It's like we we need to go, we need to we need to leave here and just go run around Leicester Square. Yeah. What would you call that? A veranda. Yeah. Thanks very much, Molly. Good Bye. Thank you for having me. Bye.